Tens of thousands of people showing their pride in Italian-American heritage. It's the country's biggest Columbus Day celebration. We have live pictures from Chopper 2, high above the parade right right now. A beautiful late morning, early afternoon for this parade. Over 30,000 people expected to be along the parade route. CBS 2's Tony Aiello is along the route on Fifth Avenue with our top story here today. Tony. I know you're wondering how a guy named Tony Aiello got this assignment on Columbus Day. I am the proud grandson of Francesco and Francesca Aiello from Bagadia, Sicily. There are almost 3 million Italian Americans in the New York metro region, many of them here today. And if you're not Italian, you love someone who is. You can see there's thousands and thousands of people lining the route. We've got parade floats that are now coming down. Governor Hochul and Comptroller DiNapoli have um, walked by as well. This is a fund, uh, Gabelli Fund, Mario Gabelli. He always has a float in this parade. Lots of young children up there showing their Italian pride, some of them wearing headphones because it's a little loud. It's loud all along the parade route. A full 10% of New York City residents claim Italian heritage. The annual display on Columbus Day, a reflection of the pride they feel, as well as a determination to keep alive the connection to the old country. Rosalia Campo does it for her children. I try to keep it um, alive just the same way my family taught me, the traditions or whatnot, trying to keep the, the food and the holidays always together and the Sunday dinners and things like that. Italy is an ancient land, but as a single unified nation, it's younger than the United States. Modern Italy is a collection of 20 regions with distinct dialects, cuisines, and cultures, each having a moment on Fifth Avenue that brings them out year after year. Every year here since 1980, uh, that's when I started the job, and religiously, Columbus Day Parade. What brings you out year after year? Oh, uh, year after year, it's a beautiful thing for the family. Uh, we got a whole family here, we got all our friends here, and Columbus Day must live on, and this is why we're here for Columbus Day. The Italian Americans have made an, uh, an input in New York City and continue to do so. They are very famous Italian Americans uh, that helped build this city and build this country. They came over here in this beautiful country. America is amazing. New York is amazing. Look what you see around, you know. Italian Americans and New York. That's Amore. And this is the Italian Welfare League float. They raise money to help what they call i nostri bambini, young people in need of help, many of them with medical issues. I'm proud to say I am a longtime supporter of the Italian Welfare League, and I'll be emceeing their lunch for about the eighth or ninth time coming up on November 13th. It's great to see so many young Italian Americans at this parade trying to connect with a culture, even as they're two or three generations removed from the relative who came here from the old country. Reporting live in Midtown, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Tony, you were right. We picked the right man for the job today. Good to see you out there. Thanks so much, Tony. <laughs> today, also 